All right. So um, for this particular problem, it says what products will result when HPO42 minus is added to water? Complete and balance the reaction below. Ba base your answer on the value of Ka or Kb for the substance. Well, we're talking about HPO42 minus, which can be an acid. We can tell it can be an acid because it has an H in the front. And it can be a base because it's got a negative charge. And uh, we're sort of used to negative things like CH3COO minus the acetate ion. Um, and in fact, some problems, A minus is the form of the anion that is the, uh, sorry, they, these can be bases. The, um, negative things can be bases. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my um, uh, K, KB uh, conversion equation sheet part here. And I've got it. And let's see. So here's phosphoric acid. Phosphoric acid has Ka1 equals 7.5 times 10 to the minus 3. Ka2 equals 6.2 times 10 to the minus 8. And Ka3 equals 4.2 times 10 to the minus 13. So this one has one proton which means it has lost two protons. So uh, so H3OPO4, that would be for Ka1. Ka2 would be for H2PO4 minus. And Ka3 would be for HPO4 two minus. So for this substance, Ka3 really is 4.2 times 10 to the minus 13. But this can also be a base. And if it's a base, if this is a base, then its conjugate acid will be with one more H. So it's going to be H2PO4, one minus, because you're putting an H plus on there. And the Ka, as we said, for H2PO4 minus was 6.2 times 10 to the minus 8. Therefore, Kb for HPO42 minus is going to be Kw over Ka of 6.2 times 10 to the minus 8. Kw is 1.0 times 10 to the minus 14. So plugging that into our calculator, our handy dandy calculator. Sorry, I was channeling Dora the Explorer. Or no, Blue's Clues was there for a minute. And now X minus 14 minus divided by 6.2 X minus 8 minus. I get 1.6 times 10 to the minus 7. So that's the KB for our substance. Here's the KA for our substance, because this substance, like I said, can be an acid or a base. And the Kb is larger than the Ka for the same thing. So that means it's going to be a base. That means that water is going to be the acid. We're going to end up with hydroxide and H2PO4 minus. And similar levels of thinking will be involved for the other versions of these problems.